Good morning. This is Tanya Elder with Realty Partners. I'm a broker associate and I wanted just to give you a few tips this morning about uh, joining your re local realtor board. Now we all have to do it. However, you really getting involved and taking advantage of the services that they provide, the committees that you can be on, and the networking available. Let's face it, when most of us join as agents, we will go and take maybe a class or two with the required MLS, but so few agents really go and look at that calendar every month and see what's available, sign up for classes, usually free. You're already paying for the association. Take advantage of the ones that might work for you or getting involved with the different um, committees. It's not hard to join. In fact, one of committees I was on they asked me and another one I asked um, if they needed any assistance and they really welcome agent input at many of these uh, the membership meetings it's just a great way to get involved learn more about real estate connect with other agents you never know when it's going to turn into a referral or you know more business and if you're on those committees it's a great thing to put on your resume um, as far as, you know, for your buyers to let them know what you do and your biography and to put on your listing presentations. You know, buyers and sellers like to know that you're involved with the community, that you're involved with your local ed, um, association, because to them it shows that you really want to continue and you're serious about real estate. So think about it. Contact uh, your local board. It's October now. This is about the time that they're looking to find out who's going to be on the committees for next year. So, um, you know, just pop in. It, it's a great thing. Thanks. Have a great day.